Nerds! Welcome to Nerd Magic, time to get nerd up. Okay nerds, in this video I will be doing a OnePlus 5T kernel installation and the name of the kernel that I will be showing you how to get and install is called the Freedom OS kernel. Now all you have to do, click on the link in the description below. It will send you to this URL, just download the latest version of the kernel, which is the one at the bottom. Okay, once the download process is complete, you just want to go into TWRP Recovery. I will be going there utilizing the Quick Reboot application that I got from the Google Play Store. Once you're in recovery, the very first thing I recommend doing is to do a backup just in case everything don't work out as how it should with installing the kernel. Once you're finished doing the backup, click on the wipe tab. Then you want to click on advanced wipe. Tick Dalvik cache and cache. Then swipe right to wipe. Once you're finished doing that, you just want to go back. Then click on the install tab. Once you click on the install tab, just simply go to the path of wherever the hell you downloaded that kernel. I downloaded mine in my download folder. Then just simply swipe right to flash. Once the flash is completed, you just want to click wipe cache. That's my best practice. Then you just want to reboot your system. Once your phone has finally rebooted, hey, that's pretty much it. The kernel has been installed. The Freedom OS kernel has been installed. And just for proof, you can just simply go on and need settings. Click on about phone. Then let me see which part you go from here. Just look at kernel version and right there will show you the information you need to know so that way you know you have the Freedom OS kernel installed. And guys, that's pretty much it. It will look like this if you have the appropriate kernel installed. And that's it guys. I will do a follow up video reviewing this Freedom OS kernel. It will more likely be like a walkthrough just telling you everything that is in the kernel, all the changes compared to the stock kernel. What are the benefits of having this kernel? If I encounter any type of crashes, if my battery lasts longer, if the system move faster, I'll go through all of that with you on a follow up video with this Freedom OS kernel. And if you find this video helpful, show some love by subscribing and have yourself an awesome day and I love you guys.